The best ideas and the best solutions come from diverse teams, and women are part of that picture. What really got me fired up about wanting to create Lit was looking around the leadership table and only seeing myself. I've been a woman in technology for over 20 years, and I've found that we don't frequently support each other. I sent an email to Melissa Kohler and said, hey, what do you think? We threw the idea out there, and all these women raised their hand and said, let me be a part of that. It's individuals that saw a need and actually created something that they saw as an opportunity to bring women in technology together. We decided from the get-go that we're going to grow our technology organization the right way so that we're bringing diversity and inclusion and women into the workplace from the beginning. We dabble in every single type of code language or tool that you could imagine. Ladies are able to find connections with other women and then be mentored and coached. I do get to interact with so many great women across the company. You just have so many people who are willing to help you learn. Young girls need to see strong women in tech so they know when they grow up that they can do that too. I'm the father of a 14-year-old girl and I want her to be able to grow up in an environment where she doesn't face the biases that exist in technology. Lit gives them a connecting point to other women where they can go and ask questions. If we can make those resources available to women coming up, that is the thing that will change the game. There are so many tangible benefits you see from programs like this from a standpoint of mentoring, development, networking. Turner's not only a great place to be a technologist, but it's a great place to be a woman technologist. I am a self-professed geek for sure.